Hey, what's up everybody? This is Chris and I'm bringing my very hot take review of the series finale of Game of Thrones, which just aired. I just finished watching it. Um, and like a lot of the episodes this season, I've got a lot of mixed feelings, but I think I can sum it up in a parenting phrase that we've all heard before that I think works for this, at least for me. And again, this is just one person's opinion. Everybody likely is going to have a different take on this, but for me, I think it just kind of comes to, uh, you know, I'm not mad, I'm just disappointed. <laughs> a phrase we've probably heard before. Um, I just didn't find this this finale satisfying at all. There were some parts of it that I thought worked really well. I thought whenever John uh, had a moment alone with Danny and did take a second to express the fact that he does love her, even though he knew what he had to do based on you know everything he had observed in King's Landing in terms of her basically mastering, massacring everybody in her path, and the conversation that he had with Tyrion, uh, you know he did still love her, but he ultimately knew that she had to die. She could not be left to rule because of her tyrannical nature and everything that had happened as a result of that. And the speech that she gave after taking over the Iron Throne suggesting that she was not done, she was going to move on to the rest of the world and take over everything, really just sort of hammer home, hammered home the point that she was a tyrant, she was going to continue to be a tyrant, he knew he couldn't let that go on. So that part of it I was totally fine with. Um, what I was not fine with was Bran taking over the throne at the end. So. You know, if you're watching this, I assume you've seen the episode, but they have a council meeting where all of the, the lords of the various houses of Westeros come together and nominate someone to be the king based on Tyrion's recommendation after he's locked away by Danny for betraying her because of uh, you know everything that had begun to happen with Jon Snow and then primarily really for letting Jamie out um, while he was in custody. Um, he sort of suggests then that everyone should put forth a nomination and he goes on to say that really the power of stories is what unites us, which seemed really kind of out of nowhere to me a little bit. And then he suggests that Bran be the ruler. Everyone's on board with this except for Sansa, who says that the North has always been separate. It will continue to be separate. She, therefore, will be the queen of the North, and Bran agrees to this. So to me, it just seemed completely out of the blue. Um, to me, the writers maybe seemed a little bit tone deaf to the characters that fans were really rooting for. Um, even though I don't have a huge problem with Bran uh, in general, I think from a writing standpoint, they abandoned his character for too long and then found a way to kind of shoehorn him back in toward the end of the show without a whole lot of character development or a whole lot of explanation between what was going on with him and the Night King, where he was sort of warging out to during the last uh, battle of Winterfell, all that sort of stuff. So it felt to me just a little bit ham-fisted. And he's just one of those characters that felt like he didn't do a whole lot, I think, from a lot of people's perspectives. And so it just didn't feel all that earned and a little bit out of left field. Um, I'm not saying that having John be on the throne would have been the best way to end it, but it would have been a little more satisfying to me. So my hot take is that I didn't really like it. You know, my opinion may change after repeated viewings if I do go back and watch this again. And after a little more time to reflect on it, but you know, having just finished the episode, I think it was just not all that great and ultimately was disappointing uh, the way things worked out. Um, so that's my opinion. Uh, if you have a different opinion, let me know that in the comments. If you like the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you like the content, be sure to subscribe. Again, I may go back to the show and take another look at it at some point, but right now, Again, I'm more disappointed than anything. I thought they could do a little bit better with the characters they had, um, especially with John ending up uh, on the wall yet again by his own brother because of the fact that he had to oust a tyrant. It just, to me, didn't make a whole lot of sense. So, again, that's just my opinion. But let me know what you think. Thanks for watching the video. Have a great night.